The LAV-3 Kodiak Armored Personnel Carrier is a licensed produced version of Swiss Moag Piranha IIH. Vehicle is produced by General Motors Land Systems. It entered service with the Canadian Army in 1999. At some point Canadian Army operated 651 of these armored vehicles in various versions. The LAV-3 was the primary Canadian mechanized infantry vehicle, which replaced the M113 and other vehicles. It formed the backbone of the Canadian Armored Vehicle Fleet. Since 2011 Canadian Army signed contracts to upgrade 616 of its LAV-3 vehicles to a LAV-6.0 standard. Deliveries reportedly commenced in 2015 and are planned to be completed in 2017. Export operators of the LAV-3 are USA and New Zealand. The US Army uses a modified variant, called Striker, which is fitted with remote weapon station in place of the turret. The Kodiak has improved armor protection, comparing with previous Swiss Moag Piranhas. Basic armor provides all-round protection against 7.62mm rounds. A ceramic add-on armor can be installed for a higher level of protection. It protects against 14.5mm machine guns fire. Some sources claim that front armor of the Kodiak with add-on armor plates can withstand hits from 30mm cannons. It makes the LAV-3 one of the most protected armored personnel carrier in the world. This armored vehicle can be also fitted with a cage armor, which provides protection against anti-tank rockets. Undercarriage was strengthened for improved mine blast survivability. Vehicle is fitted with an automatic fire suppression system and NBC protection system. In 2009 to address the threat of improvised explosive devices in Afghanistan the Canadian LAV-3s were fitted, with new belly and side armor, as well as energy-absorbing seats. Though this increased the weight to 23.6 t. The LAV-3 Kodiak is fitted with a two-man turret, armed with the M242 Bushmaster 25mm chain gun and coaxial 7.62mm machine gun. One more five. 56mm machine gun is positioned on top of the roof. The 25mm chain gun fire standard NATO 25mm ammunition. It has a 2400M range of effective fire. Both gunner and commander can fire the gun. The Kodiak has a crew of three, and can carry six to seven troops. Soldiers enter and leave the vehicle through the rear ramp or roof hatches. Vehicle is powered by a Caterpillar 3126 diesel engine, developing 350 horsepower. It is fitted with a central tire inflation system, which allows to adjust to different terrain, thus extending cross-country mobility. The LAV-3 Kodiak armored personnel carrier is not amphibious. Variants ISC Armored Personnel Carrier CPV Command Vehicle TUA Anti-Tank Guided Weapon Carrier OPV Artillery Forward Observation Vehicle MMEV Multi-Mission Effects Vehicle ELAV Armored Engineering Vehicle Striker Armored Personnel Carrier, in service with US Army Enzalave Armored Personnel Carrier, in service with New Zealand Army LAV-UP or LAV-6.0 is an upgraded version of the LAV-3. Since 2011 Canadian Army signed contracts to upgrade 616 of its LAV-3 vehicles to the new standard. Deliveries reportedly commenced in 2015 and are planned to be completed in 2017. Upgraded vehicles have a double V-shaped hull for improved protection against landmines and improvised explosive devices. Upgraded vehicle has a more powerful engine, developing 450 horsepower. Other improvements include new turret sights and improved fire control system. It is planned that upgraded Canadian vehicles will remain operational until 2035. The LAV 6.0 is also being proposed for various export customers. Saudi Arabia ordered a large number of these armored vehicles, 